Hey guys, this is Shay with Chalkin' with Shay. Uh-oh, my iPad just died. <laughs> Let me get this plugged in. Okay, today we are going to be inking a shirt. So, the first thing that we need to do, we have lots of materials here, but first, We're going to have to, hi Angel, we're going to have to um, just iron the shirt a little bit because you just want to iron it and make it um, real, you know, flattened out. Hi Debbie, flattened out um, before you start inking it. Okay, so um, first I'm just going to... Before I get started, I'm going to share this into my um, VIP group. And just a reminder, if you guys are not in my VIP group, you want to make sure you join that. So, um, comment below. Um, hi, Jamie. Comment below VIP if you're not in there. Because um, I'm going to be doing some specials. Speaking of specials, I um, am going to be doing a sale in uh, my VIP group next week, next Thursday. Um, I can't remember that date. Whatever that date is, next a, a week from yesterday. So if you're not in there, make sure you go in there. Okay, so I'm just using my heat press here to iron this a little bit. It really did not need to be ironed, but... I just wanted to make sure that I got it real good before starting. So this is um, my Cricut Easy Press, and that is a 12 by 12 by 10 size. Um, okay, Jamie, I will send you a link. The 23rd. Thank you, Angel. All right, so we're ready to go. So the first thing that we need to do is get our ink mat. And we're just going to stick this guy in here. This ink mat is um, sticky. So, what it does is it holds the shirt in place while you're inking on it. It can be kind of tricky getting it on there, but then you got it pretty good. It'll stay in place once you get it on there. Let's see. Is even able to see what I'm doing here. Let's see, this seems to be off a bit. Um, this might be okay. So before I put the transfer on, I want to make sure that it's as evenly spaced in the middle as I can. It's not rocket science, it's just a visual, you can, you can get it pretty easy just by, um, you know, visually placing the transfer onto your shirt. Okay, so we're using, um, this is the Choose Happy. Um, this is um, a creative kickstart, which is a special that we are doing this month. Um, this transfer is only available this month. You can purchase it on my website only. Um, I am not able to get it for anybody. You have to go straight to my website in order to get it. But there's two different designs. One is Choose Happy 
And the other, um, hang on, let me grab it. The other one is Live Your Dreams. So these, um, some of the design designers are coming up with some really super cute designs with these. Um, but these are bundles, so you're going to get the, a surface. You're going to, um, you're going to get a uh, nine by twelve Grayson surface. You're going to get three chalks, I believe, and then also the transfer. So that's what comes in that package. But I'm not using it on the grace, and I'm using it on the shirt with some ink. Because I've seen some really cute shirts out there. I do wish that I had a black shirt, because I think this would look much better on that. But um, I think this will be good, too. Okay, so um, we have our ink mat. We've got our inks. And... Here we go. And we don't need to fuzz when we're working with ink because we want it to be sticky. I'm really going to like this design, I think. Okay. Um, I'm just trying to visualize the colors. Um, all right, I think I'm ready to go. Let me just see. Hang on one sec. I just want to. Yeah, Angel, it is so great that you can do so many different ideas with the design. You can um, just take one design and use it, make it 20 different ways. And even just changing up the colors makes all the difference in the world. Okay. Um, let me see here a minute. we go. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. Um, I thought that I would use some variations of purple and a little bit of pink. This is marvelous. And we have Mobilis, Fig, and Regal. And then we have Eucalyptus and White. So, I'm a little nervous to start this one just because um, it just looks different from all the others. All right, so I'm going to... This is kind of going to be a real coloring, coloring job, I think. Okay. So I'm going to use the eucalyptus for some of the greenery. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Can you guys see okay? Now, something that's really cool that some designers have been doing is putting this on a, uh, a box frame, outlining the whole thing in black, and then they're taking a paintbrush and they're watercoloring. They're adding a little bit of water to it and then they are 
actually painting it in like a watercolor and it looks really cool. So I am gonna try to do that tomorrow just so that you guys can see a totally different way to um, use these designs. Okay. What are you guys up to tonight? Anybody going out and doing anything? Do people still do that at our age? I don't. I never go anywhere or do anything. I'm just kind of lame that way. I prefer it. I'm a homebody. And I don't really love to go out. But my husband's out of town, too, so for me, it's just chilling at home. You guys are definitely going to want to stay here till the end because this is going to look really cool when I pull it off. Some of these you have to do left-handed. So comment below and tell me what you guys are doing tonight. I'm gonna have to take a peek and see what this looks like so far. The great thing about Chalk Couture is you really cannot mess it up. I mean, you can make it look so many different ways and it may not look exactly the way you had intended it to look but it'll still look pretty darn cool, I bet. And if you do mess something up, at least with the chalk anyways, you can easily just redo it. If any of you guys are, you like to stay home too, Angel? Um, if any of you guys are local to Cincinnati or Dayton, um, ugh, I am having a workshop on uh, January 31st. We're going to be inking. So you guys are going to want to come to that so that I can teach you how to ink. Okay, I think I'm done with this color. And I'm going to have to take a peek because I don't know what it looks like and I'm so curious. Okay. So it's looking good. So now, um, I'm going to cut, I'm going to start doing some purples. need another multi-tool. And this, this doesn't have to be exact.
I think I'm going to have to do some coloring in. Um, let's do another dark purple down here. All right. Okay, so that, so it, what it's doing is it's doing the outline of the flower. Can, I, don't, I don't know if you guys were able to see that. Hi, Megan. Um, so that really was just kind of doing the outline. And Okay. So I'm going to do a little bit around it. Whoops. I don't think I'm going to do I don't think I'm going to do every single, I'm not going to color it all in. Like pretty soon here, I'm going to take the white and I'm just going to go over the whole thing. Okay, so that was that color purple. So now we're going to do some of the light purple to give it a two-toned look. hard to see this purple on the gray. I really wish that I'd had a black shirt. I think that would have made it better. Okay, so we have two of the light purples. Now we're going to do some pink. Oh, this is a new one. This is the Marvelous. Yikes. Got to be careful here. Now, the ink is permanent. So, if you get it somewhere it shouldn't be, you're going to kind of have a problem. But the more you do this, the better you get. I messed up a lot of things in in the beginning, but now I'm pretty pretty skilled. It just takes practice, just like anything else. Okay. So we're gonna make some of these little flowers pink. time is it? 5.40? I'm getting hungry. I haven't eaten yet. Well, I guess no one probably has. It's only 5.40. Okay.
I need a little of the green. I found some greenery down here. I should not have put that multi-tool away. I've got five multi-tools sitting on my desk because sometimes you just need five. But I have found that I never need more than five. So it's good to know that that's a good number to have. Okay. I'm going to add a little more pink on the right side just to even it out a little bit. Get some little flowers. Um, what color should I make that? I think I'll do the light purple. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use white for the whole rest of it. And I hope that I like it. If not, I might be throwing this shirt away. It was cheap enough. I, it, I don't remember. I think I got it at Joanne Fabrics. Okay, so let's just use a uh, mini squeegee. I'm going to clean up this white a little bit. It was kind of all hanging around the sides. Okay. We're just going to kind of do a little bit of blending to kind of fill in the rest. And if some of the colors blend in together, that's going to be okay. got it all over my thumb. I need to get it off my thumb. I don't want to get it on the shirt. Okay. Inking is a little easier because you don't have to go so fast like you do with the chalk. With the chalk, you've got to, you know, make sure you get that transfer pulled off quickly so that it does not um, come up off of the surface. But with ink, you can just take your time. Ugh. I think a small squeegee would have been better here. I'm going to enjoy uh, doing the watercolor with this one tomorrow.
We're almost done. Okay, now I'm going to pull up the excess. All right, let's see what it looks like. You ready for the big reveal? There we have it. Okay, I think, let me, oh, hold on guys. I'm just trying to stick this in the water. Okay, let's evaluate it. Okay, so, um, I do like the white better than I thought I would. Um, I kind of feel like maybe what I should have done was done the whole thing in white and then maybe gone over it. Hi, Carla. And then gone over it again in the different colors. And in fact, I think what I could do is once this, um, once I wash this transfer, and this dries, I can go over it again in the white, the whole thing, and then um, that will make it stand out a little bit more. Um, Cause I, the issue that I think we're having here is that um, you the choose happy, like the actual words are not showing up as vibrantly as they should be. Um, so I think that that's what I need to do, but let me show it to you guys. And I gotta be very careful because I still have all my inks out here. Okay, what do you guys think? I think it's very pretty. And give me some hearts if you guys like it. Okay, so we're gonna have to wait for this to dry. And then I'm gonna have to play around with it just to make it perfect. Um, it's, it's a good start, but it just needs a little more work. So, all right, I wanted to tell you guys, I am having um, a Chalk With Me live event where you guys, how it works is you guys purchase a, a bundle and then we all chalk together. So it'll be just like I'm doing right now, but you guys are gonna have your own bundles and supplies to create this bundle with me. So if you are new to Chalk Couture, this is your chance to um, learn how to do it. I will send you um, for $35, you will get this board and base, which is um, the most versatile. I love this um, surface because it's so versatile. You can make a design like this or like this, and then you can do both sides. So it's really an awesome um, design or a uh, surface. So for that $35, you will get the surface. You will get the chalk of your color of your choice. Um, of your color choice and you will also get the transfer to make this so it's going to be a lot of fun because we're going to all do this together and you guys can learn how to do it so if you are interested in that comment below chalk with me and then i will send you an invoice for the 35 dollars um, plus shipping and tax um so we're going to be doing the live portion of that uh, very or in early February once I figure out um, like how many people are actually doing it I'd like to try to find a date that works for all but if you can't make the actual date of the live video it's still fine because you can follow along with us with the recording so that's cool um, the other thing is if you guys like this um, choose happy design or the, the this one here, Live Your Dreams, um, 
you've got until the end of January to purchase these. And right now, this Live Your Dreams is out of stock, but they thought it was going to be coming back later today. So I would grab these up while you can. They're only going to be available in January. No, not past that at all. It's just an exclusive design just for this month. The other thing, if you guys were interested in joining, we are currently having a joining special this month where you get two extra transfers for free. Um, they don't normally do specials at all, but right now they are doing a special where you get two transfers for free. So now is the time to join if you are thinking about this um, as a way to make some extra money. So, all right. Well, thank you guys for watching me tonight, and I will see you all later. Bye-bye.